I thought I'd just jump on to have a quick video because I'm back with my squirrel friends. If you can see them. I've um, got the one that keeps coming up and trying to eat nuts off me. I just wanted to pop on um, because I've been listening to some stuff today, a bit mostly at work, and I realised that everyone's saying the same thing. Everyone is saying the same thing, which is we create our own reality with our thoughts, with our words, with everything. So if we continually think negative things like I've been doing lately about situations I'm in, about friends, about family, I'm just going to create more of it. But I guess it's trying to work out how to bring yourself into that that light, that love, that, that feeling of complete joy and happiness and positivity and keeping in it all the time because it's not easy. We live in a really strange world at the moment. Like everything that we knew was from 2020 has, has completely changed. A lot of people have gone back to their normal lives, but was there anything normal? We can see there are more and more control measures being put in. When I walk into a supermarket now, you just get greeted by a, a, a screen that is taking your biometric, your facial image. Why? Surely you've got a question, why are they doing that? Their excuse is your safety and, and shoplifters and all the rubbish. No, it's not. It's total surveillance. Total surveillance over everything you do. That's why their cameras are everywhere. And we, we have to stand up and say, we don't want this. Did, do we ask for this? Did we ask to have surveillance on us 24-7? I don't think so. I saw a man yesterday when I was in the shops and he was very chatty and he kept apologising for being chatty and he said, since 2020, all I want to do is chat. And I got that because people were isolated. People were taken away from their families. Social distancing when the one thing people want to do is, is hug and show compassion for each other and love. Hugging, there's, there's no benefits for it. So what was their purpose to do that? To, to destroy, to, to take away. Oh, excuse me, I have someone I have to feed. Don't I, look, you gonna say hello? I'm not sure what happened there. I think my video ran out. And I don't know what I was talking about. So I'll just go back and say that I do believe that we do really can create our own, manifest our own reality. So dream big. Dream big and visualize it every day. Visualize the place where you want to be. Visualize the people you want to be surrounded by. Visualise what you want to do and just make it a reality. Because I do honestly believe that we can do it. I, I manifested quite a few things in my life. And I know I've manifested negative things as well. But we are so much more powerful than you could ever imagine. I hear it all the time and I really have to believe that it's true. And this world that we live in is, is so much better and bigger if we join together and work together as a community to build what we want. If we all have the vision of peace, if we all have the vision of love, then we can make it happen. 
okay, well, I wish you peace, love and light, just in case my squidgy comes back and wants more um, food. Um, and it's getting a bit busy in here now. So I just wanted to hop on and um, share my thoughts. <laughs>